how to sell digital products on Big Cartel. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can sell your digital products within the platform of Big Cartel. Big Cartel is very well known for creating stores and also online stores for the small businesses. So it will help you a lot to achieve, for example, a, a number of selling between the uh, right there transition phase of your debut and also the uh, professioning of the uh, selling online. It is very easy and very simple. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to visit the cartel. Right there, you are going to sign up for an account or log in. Once you have created an account, you will see right there the dashboard. As you can see, I have already set everything and also here in few steps, everything is connected. If you want to add your digital product right there, you're simply going to search through this menu from here on the header and click on products. We have orders, discounts, and also the account information. But let's go ahead directly to the topic and click on product. Now, as you can see, we have some products that I have added. So if you want to add a product, simply go ahead and click on the plus sign to add a product. If you want to add some more products or in bulk import, you're going to click on the three dots right there and there you are going to enable the bulk editing. And also you can add the product with bulk. So I will let you see right there that I have exceeded the number of the products that has been allowed for me. So I need to delete a product right there. I'm going to delete any product. So Go ahead and uh, free up some space. We'll go ahead and click on add a product. Now, all we need to do is to put up the name of the product, the description, add a category, put the status as active, of course, and also the pricing. So let's go ahead and begin with the product name. For example, I'm going to sell Canva templates like that. We're going to set templates and we have the title for description. I'm going to be short in here and put the same title. We're going to get, for example, a detailed description like five templates like that. Templates fully editable and etc. Right there, we're going to put uh, here some, let's say, some more details and simply are going to set. Uh, the categories and I'm going to click on the plus sign here. You can go ahead and modify or manage the category. For example, I'm going to set a category for digital products and now we are going to save it. Add it to this category and here we have the price. For example, let's start by uh, $25.99. So. We are going to see the shipping profile. You're going to set the default and here we have variants. You can add a variant and also you can add a group. After you have added the digital product right there, you need to add the images. And here we have a display up to 25 images when you upgrade. But on the free plan, you can go ahead and right there and add only a one picture. When you have saved and successfully added the product, it will be go in right there and be listed for the products. So whenever you click on the products, you will see it right away. Now you can go ahead and add a discount for the specific product, but you need to upgrade to the premium plan. Now let's go ahead to the account. I will let you see right there how we can add the payment methods, which is very important. Now you can go ahead and see the shop design. Click on to the shop designer right there and set up your shop because you are going to add a product within the pages or the website of Big Cartel. It will let you create a virtual or an online store. Then you are going to see it like this. Go ahead and set the products and you will see the description title. Here we have the prices and also the description itself. So whenever you are going to click on add to cart, the customers will be get or set to the checkout. When you click on the checkout, 
it is very important to make sure that you have required the um the necessary parts for selling or the fulfillment of the digital products and how we can fulfill that you're going to demand at the checkout the email address once you have done that you're going to deliver the file which is for example a pdf if it is a ebook or it is for example a canva template you're going to deliver a link and also you're going to deliver the pdf version let's see right here how we can add a different method or a payment method you're going to exit this one so we are going to exit this website and we are going to see right there the get paid you're going to click on edit your payment method and right there we have stripe and we have paypal these only two options that are available on big cartel for me here i think it is uh to or due to the country regions and also the um or there are the countries uh here we have it it depends on your country that you have opened up the account from we're going to see some different method maybe so this head over canva and i will let you see here how we can create a digital product so over there we need to define the type of the product of or the digital product that we are going to create here we have a lot of choices go ahead into canva then you're going to sign in into an account you can google or use your google account and then you're going to click on search on your contact or right there on the search bar and type the type of the product for example here i will give you an idea of ebook you're going to set ebook or electronic book and you will see here the templates here we have a lot of templates go ahead and select any of these templates for example like that and then you are going to customize it click on customize and here we have the editor right away you can see that this is already a ebook or a ready ebook you can go ahead and modify it also you can uh, go and set whatever you want for the titles and also you can go ahead and do whatever you want for it so this was for the ebook example now i will go ahead and set or design a template for canva so how can we do that we're going to select for example let's say we are on the home page we are going to set instagram posts instagram posts like that then we are going to click on enter here we have some posts on instagram with the right format we have the square the portrait and etc go ahead and choose whatever you want from these for example this one and then we are going to set it like this so go ahead and delete the parts that you don't want for example this one and we are going to need something like right there let's go ahead and set a photo for example or i'm going to add a frame frame like this frame so we are going to add a frame like this one and i'm going to set it like this and make a title for it this place for example of your logo and then we are going to set it right there logo put it right there and place it here above the photo now we are going to add a text box as a description for example description here and we are going to make it a little bit bigger so we are going to set and we need a frame another frame for this specific photo like this and we are going to duplicate this text and make it a little bit right there transparent to not confuse it within the uh, also the text box so we are going to set here photo here and then you are going to set some stickers i'm going to add stickers stickers and we are going to see the graphics add a graphic like this one so we are going to set this like that you are going to set it you can go but this is a gif so it will be disappearing and also going to be a static button and for the specific one we are going to set something for the stickers go ahead and add a sticker as a photo so we're going to add these two cherries just to modify the photo so how can we share that specific 
with your template you're going to click on share and then we're going to set or get a collaboration link go ahead and click right there and anyone with the link can modify and also edit make sure to set it like this as editor so we can edit copy that link and then that link going to be clipped or copied to the clipboard go right there into the customer that have bought this template and send them uh, to the email that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one